guys welcome back to my channel thank you all for stopping by today i'm going to show you how to make this delicious fried jerk chicken to get started i already washed and prepped my chicken in some lemon juice and i'll be using some dry jerk seasoning black pepper ginger powder chicken bouillon seasoned salt and some homemade jerk seasoning so here's how i prepare the jerk seasoning you'll need some onions garlic scotch bonnet peppers some thyme scallion uh, lemon juice vinegar some oil i'll be using some soy sauce i have all spice cinnamon salt and sugar so basically what i did was add all the ingredients to a blender and just blend to a chunky or smooth consistency it all depends on your own preference however you want to blend it go ahead and do so once it was done I realized that I didn't get a color that I need so I went in with a little bit of browning to give it that nice authentic um, jerk seasoning color and this is what it looks like once it's done now let's proceed to the next step so now you want to add your dry seasoning as well as some of that fresh jerk seasoning that we made to the chicken you want to mix well to combine and set aside to marinate for a minimum of two hours if you have time and you can let it go longer that would be perfect Now let's prepare the breading. Here I have some cornstarch, all-purpose flour, dry jerk seasoning, chicken bouillon, and some salt. We'll mix those to combine and set aside. Now I will leave all the correct measurements and ingredients that I use down in my description box for those that are interested. Next you want to grab about a quarter cup and add some of that flour to a separate bowl. I would add a quarter cup and a little bit more and we will add some water to that. This we will use as the batter for the chicken. We don't want a whole lot, just a little bit so that we can create moisture on the chicken so that the flour breading can adhere to it. Next, we're gonna coat our chicken nicely into that flour mixture. And we will keep repeating this process until we're all done. Then we'll head over to the stove and start the frying process. If you're new to my channel, I wanna wish you a warm welcome. And if you're returning, I wanna say, thank you for coming back i truly appreciate your support if you enjoy this video give it a thumbs up for your girl and if you have not yet subscribed i want to ask you to consider doing so now let's get into the next step of this recipe so at this point you want to preheat your oil to 350 degrees fahrenheit and you want to allow the chicken to sit for about 15 minutes just let that flour absorb in the chicken before we drop it into this hot oil now we will place the chicken in there and you don't want to overcrowd your pot you want to give them you know space to swim around and let the heat remain at a certain temperature so we will allow these to fry for about uh, let's say 8 to 10 minutes if you want to fry yours real hard you can go for about 12 minutes but yeah after about 10 minutes this is how the chicken is looking absolutely perfect now we will remove them and just carry on with the same step until we're all done And here you have it, my version of fried jerk chicken. When I tell you this was absolute fire, it was amazing, flavorful, crispy, and delicious. You will not regret trying the recipe. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it, and leave a comment down below. I will leave all the ingredients down in the description box, and I'll see you all next time. Thank you for watching. I appreciate your support, and as always, enjoy.